A rescue boat stranded for nearly a week in the Mediterranean with over 200 migrants docked in Malta Wednesday after a deal was struck between a group of EU states to take them in. Lifeline, a vessel for the German charity Mission Lifeline, had been waiting for permission to enter a port for six days after rescuing 234 migrants off the coast of Libya last Thursday. Maltese Prime Minister Joseph Muscat warned that the situation was unique and could not be considered a blueprint for handling future rescues. Once the migrants had disembarked, the lifeline ship was due to be impounded in order to carry out an investigation into the legal status and actions on the night of rescue. Mission Lifeline has come under fire from EU leaders who accuse it of contravening international laws by rescuing the migrants when the Libyan Coast Guard was already intervening. But shortly after the ship docked, the charity remained defiant, tweeting, Finally, Lifeline arrived in the port. Donate now for our next rescue missions. Extensive security measures were put in place at the dock as the ship came in. Muscat said the migrants would be processed and genuine asylum seekers will be afforded protection, while procedures will be started immediately to return those that do not qualify in accordance with the law. A spokeswoman to the Prime Minister the scene said three mothers and their babies had been taken to hospital.